Footage taken by the New York Post shows a group of more than 100 migrants tearing through fencing and barbed wire Thursday. The group pushing past members of the Texas National Guard in El Paso as they rush towards the border wall. The Texas National Guard here on state orders was taking small groups of the single adults and pushing them back into Mexico. They realized that their fate wasn't going to be to get processed and released into the United States. The incident comes in the wake of a Tuesday ruling by a federal appeals court to place a controversial Texas law on hold. The policy would allow law enforcement in the state to arrest migrants they suspect illegally entered the country. Texas has a right to defend ourselves and we will use that authority to declare an invasion and fight back against that invasion. The Supreme Court had previously given the law the green light hours before it was put on ice. We anticipated this going back and forth between the courts, but we'll continue to do what we do, um, turn over people that we apprehend to the U.S. Border Patrol and then wait for the courts to, uh, to figure out what they're going to do. But while many members of Texas law enforcement say they support the policy, the Associated Press reports, quote, there was no indication any law enforcement agency in Texas tried to arrest migrants in the roughly nine hours the law was in effect. Some officers citing a lack of jail space and transport vehicles in their counties and others hundreds of miles away from the border say it's harder for them to get proof migrants actually crossed illegally. The Texas law would also allow arrested migrants to be sent into Mexico, a move the Mexican president said he would not accept. I'm Chanley Painter, Fox News.